Our playoff march continues tonight as the Toronto Maple Leafs beat the Montreal Canadiens 3 to nothing, giving the Toronto Maple Leafs their first regulation shutout in over two years. And not only that, but this is the first uh, Leafs shutout against the Habs since all the way back in 2003. And the scoring gets off with Colton Orr getting his first goal as a Toronto Maple Leaf, as well as Jeff Finger getting a goal against Carey Price and the Habs. And in the second period, Matt Stajan gets a goal on a breakaway that was fed to him by Phil Kessel. And I do mean the puck, by the way. And so the Toronto Maple Leafs did play a great game, although Jonas Gustafsson was pulled after the first period, not because he wasn't playing bad, but because of the fact that his irregular heartbeat has occurred again. And it's not as bad as it was last time, but the, he was taken to hospital as a precaution because they don't want it to be a long-term injury. And I don't think Leaf fans want it to be a long-term injury either because he is one of our best goalies. So I don't know if this means Reamer is going to be called up uh, as Joy McDonald's back up to the Leafs. I don't know. Now... The other thing I want to mention was this is the first time the Toronto Maple Leafs have beaten the Habs on a weekday in a while, um, as well as Phil Kessel getting two points tonight. And unfortunately, he did not get a goal against Carey Price and the Montreal Canadiens. Those two points were from two assists. And uh, the other thing I did want to say was in case you guys are wondering why I'm filming with my digital camera it's because my uh, webcam I can't use it because my computer is on uh, safe mode because of something called malware and soft um, spyware um, that I got because I uninstalled some error scanning system I downloaded from www.finallyfast.com if it happened to me, I wouldn't recommend that any Leaf fan uh, would go there. Otherwise, th that will happen. So, And I also should mention, the other thing that n made this night great was the fact that the Habs fans were mostly booing, and the only people who were cheering were the Toronto Maple Leaf fans who have come up from Toronto and other parts of Canada to see the Leafs speak the Habs and uh, let's just say you know that if there's no ole 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 songs being sung then the Habs aren't really doing that well so it's nice to see the Leafs get a win our playoff march continuing and we are seven points out of eighth spot and I predict that the Toronto Maple Leafs will have eighth spot by Christmas Day and that we'll probably need at least uh, eight wins to get there. I mean, there are other teams in front of us, so chances are that they're going to get some wins as well. So, until uh, after Thursday's game, na 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 na, na 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 na, hey hey hey, have suck, na 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 na, na 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 na. Hey, 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 goodbye.